All right, guys, here's Friend of the Parrot. Now, I am I usually have him step up, and then he's going to fly across the room. But I'm just going to open up the cage and see if he can launch from the ground, or will he go on top of the cage and get a little air first. Okay, so it's going to be interesting. Here's our parrot pillow. All right, Friend, are you ready? Okay, so we're going to slowly... Okay, hold on. Ooh. All right, hold on, hold on. Now I gotta, I gotta be on the ball here. All right, Freedom, I'm gonna open up this door. Here we go. I gotta be careful. I gotta watch Freedom. We don't want to miss the flight. Golly. Is he gonna go up? See, I anticipated he was gonna climb first. Okay, here we go. Climbing, climbing, climbing. Freedom. Oh, there we go. Good boy. Good boy. He likes when I use a special voice. Good boy, Freedom. Look at you. You are so pretty. Good parrot. Freedom, you did such a good job. So if you've got a play stand, it's always great to have a couple toys that they can nibble on. Because uh, you don't want your parrot to get bored. Right, Freedom? Good parrot. Freedom, you are such a good boy. Yes, you are. And when I say good boy, he'll move his beak. Freedom, are you a good boy? Good boy. Yes, you are. Good parrot. Okay, so very quickly, I want to show you. Now, I still have to read Parrots of the Wild, A Natural History of the World's Most Captivating Birds. Um, and then Words on Waterfowl. This is from Southern Heights Bird Park. I still have a set of videos coming out. I really do. Woo! Okay, I just finished reading The Purple-Bellied Parrot. And I mentioned on an, another video that... Look how cute. It's an account of his... Lifetimes, Adventures, and Misadventures, and by William Fagus. So, that looks like a little house sparrow. Anyway, uh, the part that was hard, because I'm guessing from what I read on an interview, that I think he's in England, and he used a couple words uh, for other birds that we never heard of, because we're not overseas. And so, uh, the first half of the book, I, I was trying to interpret. There is an ind index at the back, so maybe you guys should read that first but then you don't want to ruin the story so he goes by chapter um and i'm going to read that last and it's kind of crazy but the book is adorable once you get into it i love the purple bear bellied parrot himself and he's got a nice albatross friend and it really is a, a fun book right freedom okay so we would recommend it and we hope everybody has a wonderful weekend while freedom is busy preening and looking special Yay! Okay, Freedom. All right, we're signing off live from Hilton Head Island. Have a great night.